Lawrence Paul Fox is an English actor, broadcaster, musician, and political activist. A member of the entertainment industry's Fox family, he graduated from the Royal Academy of Dramatic Art and debuted in the film The Hole. His best-known role is James Hathaway in the drama series Lewis. Born. May 26, 1978, age 45 years. Leeds, United Kingdom. Spouse, Billy Piper, M. 2007-2016. Parents, James Fox, Mary Elizabeth Piper. Party. Reclaim Party. Siblings. Lydia Fox, Jack Fox, Robin Fox, Thomas Fox. Organization founded. Reclaim Party. Lawrence Fox net worth $5 million. Early life and education. Lawrence Paul Fox was born in Leeds on May 26, 1978, the son of Mary Elizabeth Piper and actor James Fox. His paternal grandfather was talent agent Robin Fox and his paternal grandmother was actress Angela Worthington, whose father was playwright Frederick Lonsdale. He has two older brothers named Tom and Robin, a younger sister named Lydia, and a younger brother named Jack. Robin is a film producer, while Lydia and Jack are actors. Lydia is married to comedian and filmmaker Richard Iowade. Fox's uncles are actor Edward Fox and producer Robert Fox. He is also the cousin of actors Amelia and Freddie Fox, the children of his uncle Edward. Fox was raised as an evangelical Christian. At the age of 13, he was enrolled at Harrow School. He was expelled a few weeks before taking his A-level exams, and was unable to obtain a place at any university due to a report about him from Harrow. After working as a gardener and in an office, he decided to follow his family into acting, and successfully auditioned for the Royal Academy of Dramatic Art, RADA. During his time there, he appeared in numerous student productions, including the lead roles of Gregor's Worrell in Ibsen's The Wild Duck, Marcus Andronicus in Titus Andronicus, and Stephen Dedalus in an adaptation of James Joyce's novel Ulysses. He graduated in 2001. Acting career. Fox made his acting debut in the horror thriller film The Hole, 2001. He next appeared in Robert Altman's film Gosford Park, 2001. He then donned uniforms in a slew of film and television features, including roles as a German airman in Ireland at War, 2004, an SS officer in The Last Drop, 2005, and as British soldiers in the 2002 films Death Watch and Ultimate Force, and in Colditz, 2005. In the last made-for-television film, Fox played Captain Tom Willis who, after an unsuccessful attempt to break out of a prisoner-of-war camp, is brought to Offlog 4C in Colditz Castle, one of the most infamous German POW camps for officers in World War II. Actor Kevin Waitley caught Fox's performance in the last 10 minutes of the film. The next day, at a meeting regarding a new project, Waitley mentioned that Fox E would be worth taking a look at. As a result, Fox was cast in the ITV detective drama Lewis as Detective Sergeant James Hathaway, who becomes the partner of Detective Inspector Robert Lewis, played by Waitley. The pilot of this spin-off from Inspector Morse, 1987 to 2000, was ITV's highest rated drama of 2006. Fox has also portrayed Prince Charles in Whatever Love Means, 2005, Wisley, one of Jane Austen's suitors, in Becoming Jane, 2007, and Sir Christopher Hatton, the Lord Chancellor of England in Elizabeth. The Golden Age, also released in 2007. In addition, in that year Fox was seen on ITV as Cecil Weiss in Andrew Davies's adaptation of A Room with a View based on E.M. Forster's 1908 novel. On stage, Fox appeared in Mrs. Warren's Profession by George Bernard Shaw at the Strand Theatre, now the Novello Theatre, in London in 2002, and John Ford's 17th century play, Tis Pity She's a Whore in 2005. Between 2006 and 2007, he starred in Treats by Christopher Hampton with his future wife, Billy Piper. In April 2007, Fox received a police caution after he was arrested for assault when he punched a photographer outside the Garrick Theatre in London where he was performing in Treats. The caution remained on his record for three years. In 2013, Fox played Guy Haynes in Strangers on a train at London's Gielgud Theatre. On May 9, 2015, he read a letter written by a soldier three days prior to his death in the Second World War, as part of VE Day 70, a party to remember, an anniversary concert for VE Day. Fox released his debut album Holding Patterns in 2016 through his own label Fox Cub Records. His second album, A Grief Observed, was released in 2019. Holding Patterns peaked at number 89 in the UK album chart. In 2018, Fox joined the cast of the ITV series Victoria, playing Lord Palmerston, for its third season, which first aired on PBS in January 2019. In November 2020, 
Fox was dropped by his talent agency artist's rights group after stating on Question Time that an audience member's description of him as a, a white privileged male, he was a racist. He had been dropped by his previous manager's authentic talent earlier in the year. In 2021, Fox portrayed Hunter Biden in filmmaker Robert Davi's biopic My Son Hunter, starring alongside fellow conservatives Gina Carano and John James, the former of whom was also dropped by her agent after allegedly expressing some of the same opinions as Fox. The film was distributed by the website Breitbart News. Personal Life Fox met actress Billy Piper while they were performing together in the play Treats in 2006. They started dating soon after. Were married on December 31, 2007. Fox and Piper have two sons, Eugene and Winston. They divorced in May 2016. In 2024, Piper commented on the divorce in British Vogue, where she expressed the desire for her children to have privacy and anonymity, and the difficulty of this given Fox's public profile. Fox disputed some of Piper's claims. He also said that the pair had been to court many times since their split and criticized the family court system as biased towards the mother. In an October 2012 independent interview, Fox described himself as a vaguely lapsed Christian who occasionally prays and thinks the world is a better place for people who believe in God despite not having just squared that circle himself.